subject. Okay. Anyway, a couple weeks ago, Jimmy Kimmel released a clip on the iPhone 5 release where he went to the streets of Hollywood where everyone's a genius and <laughs> showed everyone an genius. iPhone 4S and was like, look, it's the new iPhone 5. Like, and so people will go and they'll be like, oh my God, like it's, it totally is thinner. It is bigger. bigger. The screen is so much yeah, clearer. Like, oh, it's 10 like, times blah, faster. Blah, 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 blah. And then they'd ask the people. What phone they already and had. And they'd be like, oh, we have the iPhone 4S. And I'm like, oh my God, people you people are, are dumb. dumb. You are what is like <laughs> problem in our society. <laughs> Like, know what kind of phone you have. Like, it's just kind of like knowing, like, what season clothes you're wearing. Okay, well, maybe not that extreme. But, I mean, like, <laughs> yeah. you know if your milk is expired or not. Yeah, because it's not that. Yeah. You should know that the phone you're holding is the one that you hold every day of your life. And it's exactly the same. Especially in today's day and age, because even, like, my parents who claim to not be so technology junkies and whatever, they're on their phones all the time. Yeah. Everyone in this society in today's day and age is constantly on their cell phone. And most people have smartphones. Well, so you it's know. hard you, to you be know like, if you like you should know that the phone in front of you is the one that you hold every day. Like how people are dumb and they get enamored by like, oh look a video camera, oh it's new iPhone 5. It's like what 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 cognitive level of thinking has stopped that you don't realize that you're holding the phone that you hold every day. Yeah. Like, smart. It's like brick. Brick. Dumb. <laughs> like, brick. Flowers. Not the same thing. And well, I think like it annoys me when people get all like giddy over like celebrities or new things or whatever. Like, I can't mean, stand that. I'm going to be really obnoxious because I was really giddy about getting a new phone, but I, my old phone was a piece of shit. Like, I was rocking iPhone vintage. <laughs> iPhone, iPhone 3. <laughs> And it got to the point where I was ready, like, I'd have to throw it on the floor. Yeah, so you would know the difference. So you're fine. But, I mean, like, they should have known the difference. And they get all excited. They're like, oh, my God, Jimmy Kimmel, blah, 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 blah. It so, wasn't even Jimmy Kimmel. It was I know. It's all like fucking staff. intern. Ugh, God, people are obnoxious. It reminds me of this one time when I was in New Mexico at Dillard's. And I had already, like torn this lady a new one because the purse department was a mess and I was like how can you expect someone to buy like nice purses for people when all of your shelving and everything is on the floor like there was like an earthquake in there so she already hated me for that so then I was over looking at the watches and like this other woman's pulling out new boxes of watches and she pulls out this like rose gold Michael Kors watch Michael Kors watch and she's like oh like these are brand new just off the runway blah 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 you know, like, you should buy one. It'd be totally hot, and, like, you'd be ahead of the fashion curve. And I was like, bitch, please. I'm like, that watch came out three years ago, and I was on the wait list for it. Like, just because you're getting it now doesn't mean it's... I have no idea what this has to do with my iPhone. The fact that people are dumb. People are dumb. Because, and you also don't like be being taken advantage of. Yeah! That was mean, Jimmy. You shouldn't take advantage of people like that. Yeah, because... I, because we've never taken advantage of people, ever. Yeah, never, ever, never, ever. I've never blackmailed anyone. I've never used my dash of good looks as sexual favors to <laughs> something that I wanted. Never. I've never hired a hitman. I have not. For reals. <laughs> I've never done that. Neither have I. Well, maybe. I've done blackmail. I've thought about it. thought about it. You own a gun. You are my hitman. I don't own a gun. <laughs> my family owns guns. Don't cross me.